Thank you much, Samir. It is 6.40. That means it's uh, 20 minutes away from 7 o'clock. Jennifer Joy Madden, or JJ to her friends, is a frequent <laughs> contributor and a former Jet reporter. I just found that out. How's it feel to be sitting back in the seat? Love it. Yeah? All yeah. right. <laughs> well, JJ is now an author, a health journalist, and a parent educator. She founded the website DurableHuman.com. Uh, and the online parenting classroom as well, because all I had to do was go like this. She talks about how we all need to be durable. Good morning, JJ. Good morning. Thank you. Tell us about this. Okay, sure. Well, actually, that's the book, but I brought a checklist today, the Family Balance Checklist. And that means about this time of year, we need endurance to get through the school year. Everything is just piling on. And so it's up to parents to make sure that they keep the kids balanced and calm. And so on the checklist, we've got five different types of time, and that is that uh, you have your got to make sure your kid gets all of this so family time right right share meals mm -hmm. obviously use this by the dinner table put your gadgets in there put them aside now do you find that's a problem gadgets <laughs> Do I? Um, <laughs> you do, huh? <laughs> I think it's a problem that you have to manage. Mm -hmm. It's part of parenting now. And so there's, then there's work time where the kids actually use, uh, they may use gadgets during mm -hmm. the day. So you have to be aware that they get the other things when they get back home at night, which is um, they get a proper place to do their homework so they don't, again, jump into the gadgets and just go into their bedroom and stay there all night. So do homework in an open place and also to have kids do chores so they feel part of the household, they, they have purpose. And that's work time. Then there's play time. Make sure they have their hour of exercise a day. Mm -hmm. Figure out, did they have gym or sports during the day? And then add on whatever they need. Go outside is really good, too. It's a stress reducer. Is and that the best thing to do when you get home from school? Maybe go outside for a little while just to kind Absolutely. of unwind and before you get back into it. For sure. And make sure that they have that time before, if they have any time left in the day to jump on gadgets and do a game, make sure they have their physical exercise first before they do those types of games. And then at night, it's quiet time. Kids have mm -hmm. this massive input all day long of information. They need time to have mental digestion. Mm -hmm. So the, make the bedroom a sanctuary, which means to remove uh, at night, especially gadgets and electronics. So they have their time to think, make decisions, and then sleep. That's the foundation right. for their total uh, success the next day, school, friendship-wise, and everything else. So it isn't anti-tech to take the gadgets out of the bed. Right, right. It's pro-sleep. And you need that blue light out of the room when exactly. you're trying to sleep. So that's durablehuman.com slash checklist. Put it on the fridge, and you'll make sure you have the kids get all their balanced activities all day. All right, JJ, thank you so much. Durablehuman.com slash checklist. Check it out. JJ, thanks for coming in. Oh, you're welcome.